Mayor Tim Kelly's office and the Chattanooga Police Department have reached a resolution to evacuate, evaluate, I should say, all CPD officers who have allegedly been untruthful on the job. In some cases, these officers might be permanently reassigned. News 12's Chris Guin spoke with city officials today about the evaluation process. He joins us now live to tell us what he learned. Chris. Well, Andrew, as of last Tuesday, any officer who is found to have violated the CPD's policy on, un on, on untruthfulness will be immediately fired. But for those who have violated the policy in the past, they may find that they're reassigned to new roles. And in some cases, some of these officers may be reassigned to non-enforcement roles permanently. Mayor Tim Kelly's office has reached a resolution with the Chattanooga Police Department to review the assignments of all police officers alleged to have been less than truthful on the job. An internal committee of sworn officers will be brought together to evaluate violations allegedly committed by 15 members of law enforcement. This was a collaborative approach with uh, Chief Murphy, Mayor Kelly, and the employee groups that were all involved uh, to really describe and define a review process uh, uh, to really make sure that uh, officers have an opportunity to be heard. Once the review process is complete, some officers may be reassigned entirely. Others may keep their assignments, but face new requirements such as having to leave their body camera on at all times. The, the chief will have latitude in this process to you know, define what those special accommodations may need to be or to assign them to a role that's you know, better suited to them. This review process applies only to officers who were found to be untruthful before August 16th, 2022. Any untruthfulness violations sustained beyond that date will be met with immediate termination. One, uh, this is about Chief Murphy setting a very high standard for integrity in her department, um, something that the mayor applauds her for and stands beside her for. Second thing is making sure that employees are heard throughout that process. Um, and then, of course, transparency is, is a part of it. Uh, I think that the employee groups and the chief have set a high standard for um, both integrity and uh, communication with the public. Police Chief Celeste Murphy said that this is not a decision that she takes lightly, but that she wants to uphold the integrity of the CPD to the public, to the courts, and to the men and women who work there. Live outside of City Hall, Chris Skewen, News 12 Now.